I'm James Paling and I'm part of the GWS Giants Academy. So I'm from a place called Toon Gabby, so um, out sort of near Parramatta, Parramatta way, like out past there, Castle Hill, like the hills near the hills area. So out through there, um, grown up there all my life, so played junior footy out at Westbrook, so Cherrybrook, Penn Hills um, area, and then moved into playing at the senior club at Penn Hills Demons. So that's where sort of I grew up around there, went to school out at William Clark College out in Kellyville. So um, yeah, it was a bit of a drive to footy and school and stuff, but no, I really enjoyed it. Footy was sort of second fiddle for when I was younger to um, mainly cricket. So growing up, I was pretty big on cricket and footy. So um, summertime was always cricket, cricket all out till like March, and then um, then footy started to roll around and. That was a cycle until about 16 and then sort of sort of drifted away from cricket. But um, yeah, cricket was a big part of my life when I was younger. As well with that, like touch football um, was pretty big through school and um, a bit of basketball a bit later on just with a few mates. So they're probably the, the other sports that ran alongside footy when I was younger and growing up. So yeah, it sort of gave everything a crack just to find out what I enjoyed. It sort of started through a bit of school, like through school footy on like a Friday when you used to play like just with a few mates from school. You used to have like little carnivals and stuff and then sort of like get talking to people and they put like send you like to a sort to a club or something like that and you start playing on the weekends and then um, from there really just got invited to come down and train with the academy when I was probably about 13. So went down, started playing there and um, the academy's it's like a big family like you're all separated, like everyone's at some, we all have our little bases, so we have like Wagga, Albury, Canberra, South Coast and um, Western Sydney, so it's just like, it's a big feeling when they all come together and we all get to catch up and um, you get to meet new people and um, be in an environment where you're in, in your region, you're potentially in like the top 50 people where you can um, train and play together, so it's, um, it's a privilege to, to be a part of a program that um, Helps want to better you as a footballer, but also as an individual with the with the programs have set up. So it's it's a good good experience to go through the academy. It's good to see like your mates getting drafted and stuff. People that you not necessarily just see like when you go to a camp and you play with them. You're like, oh, they're pretty good. Like you actually like you play locally with them or you you went to school with them or something like that. So like um, Kieran and I played at the same um, junior and senior club. So we we played played with each other for a fair bit from uh, the junior levels so that was as a positive to come out of seeing someone who worked really hard and got their opportunity and found themselves on an AFL list so it's uh, promising having people get drafted from your local area. So my parents have been super in the, in the way of they've gone about both footy and cricket when I was younger and just giving me the opportunity to just not sort of force me or corner me into any sort of sport but just be open to trying anything so um, yeah I'm really grateful with what they did um, like with bringing me up teaching me the game at a young age but also just just nurturing me and let, let, letting me go take my way my path instead of uh, yeah just getting cornered into something that they might have wanted me to do so yeah I'm very very fortunate. Being an equal top up you come in and you, you might cross over a game where someone's coming back from an injury or something and they they might have to play at one or two games in the in the reserves. So come across people who um, I'm not sure, maybe like a Harry Perryman or someone like that who also went through the academy and was one to top up and stuff like that, who come back and play one game in the reserves and you're lucky enough to play there with them is, yeah, it's good because like, they were ones where you were and that really helps like, just all the, all the top ups really feel comfortable in where they are. Just genuine people that don't think they're better or they're above anyone else, they're really down to earth and it's just good to come in and not, not feel like you're like daunting in that because they make you feel really welcome and um, it's like really welcoming to come in and just have an experience to be around people who are elite at what they do and um, just to see them being like just joking around and just, just being real, real like casual about everything they do is it's fun, like it's good to be around. This next year, like the goal, you want to get drafted. So that's every kid who's doing the program's aim. So obviously that would be the goal. But if that, if like, you're going to become a better footballer out of the academy and stuff like that. So just get the most out of myself and um, 
not really think too far ahead and just take each, each week as it comes and just try and better myself every time. That's just how I train and how I play. So.